this ace of coins, this ace of pentacles, this brings you material uh, wealth. It brings you prosperity in your life. It brings you um, great finances, new finances. This is a new stream of income for you. Welcome to your timeless tarot reading. Come on in here. This is Wasted Traditions Tarot. I'm Tiffany, your friendly neighborhood tarot reader. Let's go ahead and get started with your channeled messages. So with, with your channeled messages, uh, one of the first things that came through was building. So with building, for some of you, you're setting a new foundation. There's something uh, new coming in and you're creating the blueprint. You're designing something for some of you. Um, this could be a new home for someone. It could be adding on to your current home, but it's definitely something that is stabilizing your life. Whether this building, this foundation, this creation is a new uh, spiritual foundation or a new uh, emotional foundation you're setting for yourself, Gemini. Then I got the number six. Now, with six, this represents harmony and healing. Um, this also represents service to others. So for some of you, it feels like you're um, getting more involved in volunteer work, right? Um, take responsibility is also what I'm getting with the number six. Uh, there's something out there for someone that you have to take responsibility for. Um, we have, Gemini, we have some Sagittarius showing up in your reading. Uh, so that could be somewhere in your birth chart or what you hear in today's tarot reading could be, could involve a Sagittarius in your life. Okay, Gemini. But also with this number six comes love. Okay. There could be something shifting. This new creation, this new foundation could be shifting in the next six days, six weeks or six months for someone um, there is, uh, six surrounding six. So maybe, uh, mm -hmm. <clears throat> yes. So with this six, I do feel like six weeks is very prominent for someone out there. Something's going on in six weeks. You are likely aware of what's happening, uh, over the course of the next six weeks. I do feel that strongly for someone out there. And then next, I received running water. So for someone, there's a cleansing that needs to take place. There's a freshness uh, coming towards you. There's a renewal, okay? You're going to be making your mark. You're carving out your place in the world. Um, and that could be something that's happening in the next six weeks, right? Um, are you moving in the next six, six weeks? Are you um, getting your degree is your degree finalized in the next six weeks, Gemini, for someone out there, right? With this running water, I'm also feeling that you're untamed. Someone's been trying to tame you, Gemini, and you refuse to be tamed. You are untamed. You are powerful. Um, and what you are doing, what you're contributing is adding to the collective in a positive manner. Then next, I got complete right? Complete. Something, there's an end of a, of a cycle coming for someone is what I'm feeling. Um, it's on to the next is what I got on to the next thing with this completion. It's something is finished. You're going to get into something new, but then I'm also getting the converse side of that Gemini is you need to get it done. Some, there's been some sort of procrastination spirit is saying no more delay. You know what you have to do. You know the steps forward. Okay, Gemini. And lastly, I received the color yellow. With the color yellow, I immediately thought of the solar plexus. So someone, Gemini, you need to activate your solar ple plexus chakra, that particular energy center. That is where your personal power sits, Gemini. That is where your confidence is, okay? Um, yellow also represents joy, success, happiness, cheer, celebration. There's a celebration coming for someone and that could be in the next six weeks or also six days or six months. Um, wish fulfillment is happening for you, Gemini. Someone's been wishing deeply uh, for something to change, something to happen so that wish fulfillment is coming. So first out, we have the Empress, the Hanged Man. And temperance. Again, with temperance, 
there is a uh, Sagittarius showing up in your reading, whether that's in your birth chart or someone in your life uh, is a Sagittarius. Okay, that's that's out first. Let's see. What am I getting with your reading, Gemini? We're going to get all the tarot out. We will get clarifiers as well. Um, and likely some oracle. Mm -hmm. All right. So overall, the next steps. You know, you know what to do with this hanged man. It's taking the next step. It's taking the ne next step. You have the information you've been seeking. You've been patient, Gemini. Taking that next step. And and here with the running water, I have we have temperance, and then we see the transfer of the running water here on the temperance card. So you are definitely in power mode, Gemini. And of course, with the Empress energy, male or female, okay? Yes, this is abundance. You have been, you have been nurturing something. With this hanged man, you have been patiently nurturing something, is what I'm feeling with this Empress energy. <sighs> yes, yeah, something is absolutely ending. A lot of Mm hmm Oh, we have the Empress twice. We have the Empress twice, Gemini, just for you. Okay, there is also some... Um, you're absolutely... You're showing up in your own reading. I'm just noticing we have the lovers here. So, Gemini, you are showing up in your own reading, which is always a beautiful sign. It's always a confirmation. So, we love to see that for you, Gemini. But with this Ten of Swords, there is that completion I was feeling. Something is coming to an end for you, Gemini. It's over. Um, and then we have King of Wands and King of Swords. So you are definitely uh, creating something. Uh, that building, what I was feeling, building, creating a foundation. So the King of Wands and the King of Swords showing up in your reading. You've had this vision, Gemini, and you are stepping into your power. That yellow that I was getting, that personal power, that solar plexus a activation, your authority, you are taking the leadership role in building your vision, your dream that you've had, wish fulfillment that you've had is what I'm seeing here for you, Gemini. And then mm -hmm, with the hanged man, that patience, you've been patient. And now we have the page of cups showing up with your hanged man energy. So the patience you've had, Gemini, is absolutely uh, critical. It has sparked your creativity. Um, it has heightened your intuition while you, while you were in pause mode, while you were being patient, while you were taking a beat and trying to get clear on things. This hanged man energy, what I feel has been absolutely... Um, useful to you because the page of cups is showing up for you and it's it's letting me understand it's letting me know that this has this this time of waiting this holding pattern you've been in the patience you've had with this hangman has opened up your creativity sparked your creativity heightened your intuition and then we have the knight of cups and the lovers showing up for someone gemini for someone as i said you've shown up in your own reading so there are choices to be made with this Knight of Cups energy, uh, the choice to pursue your own happiness, to go after the hearts of your des the desires of your heart, Gemini, as you are showing up in your own reading. And then we have Temperance here. This is Sagittarius. So it could be somewhere in your birth chart, Gemini. It could be a Sagittarius you're dealing with. You have to take this how it resonates and leave the rest for someone else. But with this Temperance showing up, with the... Ten of Coins, the Empress, which is twice, and the Ace of Coins. So Temperance with the Ten of Coins is extremely, um, extremely good, extremely valuable, extreme good news for you, Gemini, right? Because there is the moderation, there is the harmony. And with the Ten of Coins showing up, the Ten of Pentacles showing up, there is harmony in your wealth and there is harmony and balance 
in your finances. There is abundance in your in your finances. What I'm feeling with this temperance, you have started the process of creating something. You are standing in your personal power with that solar plexus chakra being activated. And with the Empress showing up twice for you, Gemini, what you've been patiently and diligently concentrating on, meditating on, meditation simply means to become f familiar with. So this Empress energy is very strong. Um, you have been nurturing the ideas you've been carrying around and you've, you're trying to create that blueprint. Your blueprint is nearly complete, Gemini, with this Empress energy showing up twice in your reading. It's nearly complete and you will bring this to life you are going to bring this to life is what i'm feeling strongly and and with the ace of coins here what you build this foundation you set is stabilizing your life it's creating the new and with this this ace of coins this ace of pentacles this brings you material uh wealth it brings you prosperity in your life it brings you um great finances new finances this is a new stream of income for you Gemini, this is beautiful. Let's get some more um, clarification for you, Gemini, to kind of tie this all together for you. So overall, the, the overarching theme for you, Gemini, is that your patience has is being rewarded. Your patience is being rewarded. It's time to come out of the holding pattern you've been in for a little while now. Maybe that is something that has been happening over the last six months or the last six weeks where you were trying to be patient and create the blueprint and get the vision with that um, king of wands. You were getting your vision and creating the designing the life of your desire, Gemini. So at this point, it's time to move forward with this ten of swords. It's time to come out of holding pattern and get moving it's time to set your vision in motion all that you've considered set that in motion with that king of swords energy and yes it's the newness of it all it is going to bring great harmony to you it is going to pull things together into perspective and you are you are absolutely the authority in this new foundation that you've set for yourself and how you're building up your life with this Knight of Cups energy going after the desires of your heart, Gemini. It's time. It's your holding pattern is over is absolutely what I'm feeling with your reading. That's the overarching theme for you, Gemini. You are being rewarded for your patience. You didn't just charge ahead without a plan right and now you're being rewarded the universe is conspiring to see you win the universe is partnering with you that's also a part of the six the cooperation you have full cooperation from the universe gemini is what i'm feeling to get it done to set things in motion to create that stability that you desire to create a ten of coins uh, like to create that 10 of pentacles life for yourself that wealth and abundant abundance and your financial security the universe is in cooperation for you to get this done and be successful that yellow that i i consciously channeled the success the joy the abundance for you gemini okay three more cards divine spirit for our beautiful gemini thank you Mm -hmm. Nine of Pentacles moment. Absolutely. The fruits of your labor are going to pay off for you, Gemini. The fruits of your labor are going to pay off to you. As you were in that holding pattern with the hanged man, you were trying to understand how this is going to play out for you. How do you go about building a new life for yourself with the high priestess showing up in your reading, Gemini? That has all been revealed to you or it will be revealed to you. Gemini, right? The, the subconscious mind has unlocked to you because when you see the hanged man is has put him or herself in this position and the head glows, that is the enlightenment that comes with the hanged man. And so that enlightenment while you were with the uh, 
with the high priestess showing up in your reading, that mystery has been revealed to you as you were patient to get exactly what is for you, Gemini, right? For some of you, you feel like this, you've been in a holding pattern for far too long and you're getting a little antsy, if you will. Well, here's your sign. Spirit is saying the holding pattern ends now. You have the information you need to build the life of your desires. It has been revealed to you your your next steps and how to create um the life of your desires it's given you've gotten the blueprint on where you should where you should go and what you should do next gemini okay one more card divine spirit queen of pentacles lots of uh earth energy taurus virgo capricorn in your reading gemini they all, all the all the elements are in the reading of course right Air, earth, water, fire. Absolutely. So with this queen, <clears throat> with this queen of pentacles showing up as a clarifier, this is confirmation of your prosperity and how you have nurtured your ideas and you were patient and you didn't pull the trigger too soon, right? You were like, no, there's more to it. There's more to it. So Queen of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, um, High Priestess, all of this for you, Gemini. This is your sign. This is telling you, you know what to do. Now use what you know to create the life that you desire. Go after the desires of your heart with this, this uh, Knight of Cups pursuing what brings you pleasure because now you have the blueprint now you have everything you need your labor will be prosperous to you you will be you will have that stable life that you desire right you you know what to do next the mystery is revealed the clouds have lifted the veil has been pulled back for you gemini right and then the queen of pentacles it's you're just prosperous in this whole thing, Gemini, I'm excited for you. I want to get one more. I'm going to grab an oracle card for final advice from Spirit, Divine Spirit. Give me one more for our generous Gemini. One more. Thank you. Cut the deck. That's what I felt. Cut the deck. All right, Gemini. Forge don't follow. Here it is. This is final advice from Divine Spirit. This is absolutely tying this together. Forge, don't follow. Pave a new path. Be the leader you wish you had. That yellow, that solar plexus energy I was feeling for you. The leader. Be the leader. Activate your solar plexus, your personal power, leadership, and confidence to pave a new path in front of you. Absolutely. Building something new. How you waited patiently with the hangman energy to receive the to receive what, what was unknown to you previously and now that has been unlocked for you to receive what was unknown to you previously with the high priestess it has been revealed to you and unlocked for you in your patience with this hangman energy gemini so divine spirit is confirming it is your time now to pave that new path to start that new foundation to go after your heart's desires there's there's the running water there, there's running water all through the imagery of this card. This is beautiful. This is your confirmation. This is your sign. You know what to do, Gemini. Don't delay any further. Your patience has paid off. You will be rewarded for your patience. And now it's time to take action. Now it's time to stand in your confidence. Now it's time to let the vision be made personally. Uh in your reality, you have that fire, you have that confidence, you have that power to create your personal reality right now. This is your confirmation, Gemini. Thank you so much for watching this. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on notifications so you don't miss any further videos I have for you. You're seeing this now. This was absolutely meant for you to see. It is not happenstance. It is divine connection. I'm sending you supreme love, light, and abundance. I will see you soon. Until then, take care.